Hey everyone, so today I am here with a what's in my purse video. Wow, I haven't done one of these videos in forever. Also, don't mind the mess in the back. I just did a toddler clothing haul. I'm not sure when I'm going to upload it. I don't know, actually. It might be a couple weeks, but it's all closed. So sneak peek of all the stuff I got Avery, which is a ton. Uh, so keep on the lookout for that. But today I'm here, like I said, with a what's in my purse video. I have not done one of these videos in such a long time. And I'm going to be totally honest with you guys. The first video I feel like I ever watched... Not first video I've ever watched on YouTube, but the first video that actually made me want to make a YouTube channel was a what's in my purse video. And I was like, I kind of, I want to do that. So it feels kind of nostalgic to be doing a what's in my purse video. So this is the current bag I'm carrying. I cycle through three different bags. Um, I have one that's sort of smaller that I take when I'm like traveling or something like that. I have like a medium sized one that I take when I feel like carrying a medium sized bag. And then I have this large kind of tote style bag, which I've been carrying most recently because my purse is double as diaper bags. If you guys do not know this, I absolutely despise diaper bags. If I can carry everything in a purse or in like a little book bag, I have a cute little unicorn book bag for Avery, then that's what I do because I hate the look of diaper bags. So this purse is actually a Teddy Blake purse, which I totally love. It looks like super, super designer and the price is kind of high up there, but I will have a discount code for you guys, so I will link that down below. It's called the Blake Pomolato and it's a 16 inch tote bag and I love it, like I said, for both being a purse and also a diaper bag. So unfortunately, I have cleaned this purse out. I didn't clean it out recently. I cleaned it out like a week ago. But typically in my purse, I have a ton of like receipts. And I always, when we come home, take out all of the things that I brought for Avery, such as diapers, wipes, and things like that. So this purse is kind of empty, but this is honestly what I normally keep in my purse. Like I'm, I'm just being real with you guys. So like I said, it's a tote style purse. It has this studding along the side, which actually the first like designer thing I ever bought a Michael Kors item had was this exact color and had the studs along it so it feels very reminiscent of that and then it also has the studs along the handles as well super super easy to carry um, it is completely open you just have to pop this and that's a magnetic closure inside here I'll just pop it open so inside you have this compartment here which I usually put my keys in but since they're in our key dish I don't have it there and then there is a zip compartment in here which I don't think I have anything in Oh, I do. I have chapstick. So this is actually the Dr. Jart Ceramidin chapstick. I always have some sort of chapstick in that compartment or in my purse at all times. So that was that. I'll just open it like that so you can see. So on top I have my wallet. I do have a Michael Kors wallet. I do want to get a smaller one. Well, I have a smaller one from um, Herschel, but I think I want to get kind of like a medium sized one. This is just a big wallet. I have a ton of stuff in here always, you guys. Like I always have crap in here. Um, I mean like I'm just gonna cover my ID, but like I have so many cards and in here I have like so many receipts just like basic boring stuff I hardly clean this thing out. I actually probably should soon, but um, that's my wallet and then also I have um, Oh, this thing is kind of dirty on the inside because we went to see Sesame Street live and Avery dumped her popcorn in here So it's a little dirty. I cleaned most of it out. I tried and then I have my sunglasses case which also goes as my glasses case when I have my sunglasses on. I do have both Ray-Ban glasses, which are right here, and then I have Ray-Ban prescription sunglasses because I cannot see at all. It's a wonder I can see right now. But these are my sunglasses. Like I said, they are a prescription. They're basically the exact same style as my regular glasses. So I just keep those in my purse at all times because normally I do have my glasses on and I can just switch when we go outside. Um, and then I have a thing of tissues just in case. And then last but not least, apparently Brian threw this in my purse. It's just a Tide to Go pen. I don't normally have this. I think he got it for free from ordering from like Amazon Now or something, so he threw it in my purse. Thanks for that. But literally, like I said, I hardly carry anything in my bag. I'm, I don't know, I just, unless I'm packing things for Avery, I don't really need anything. Sometimes my phone's in here, but for the most part, this is just the basics. The skeleton, the bones of my bag. But like, then again, this bag is so, so cute. Maybe I'll do an updated what's in my purse in a little bit, maybe uh, next season, just so I can show you guys without cleaning it out what is in here. But yeah, that is it. I will have everything linked down below that I can, especially this bag, because it is so wonderful and it's structured so well. I love tote bags. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Go ahead and subscribe to my channel if you're not already, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.